So this came through the post today. Um, oh, by the way, good afternoon. Um, this came through the post today, and it's like you says, USB car charge. It's not just a car; it's for anything. It's just for my van. We're getting a new fridge. Um, I'll talk about that some other time. Well, when the fridge comes, and uh, it comes with the instructions. It says no, it doesn't come. Well, let's rephrase that. It doesn't come with instructions. What it says is that it comes pre-assembled. So pretty straightforward. All you got to do is get the box. Put the positive and negative to your battery, and you're done. So, yeah, that's what it said. Now, that's what it said. Okay. And the truth is, which is, I'm not moaning, it's fine. But that's how it came. <laughs> it didn't come pre assembled. Let's have a quick look. It came. All jumbled and unassembled. No wires connected or anything like that. So I think maybe one. Anyway, so we're going to assemble it and I'm going to show you, well, how I'm going to wire it up. I'm not saying it's the correct way, but uh, pretty straightforward, I think. It's not, yeah, there's no instructions or anything in it. Online, you, I think there's a demo, or a, not a demo, a, uh, just a piece of paper that shows you after it's wired. So we'll see. Okay, so first things first. Choose where you want your devices, where you want them. Cigarette lighter, switch on and off. Well, I'm going to put the switch on and off here. That's that's the first one I'm going to do there. So if there's anything that goes behind it or anything, I can't see. No, we've just got three washers. All the rest come with a rubber. This one doesn't come with one. So I'm going to put him at the beginning. So that goes there. Let me just tighten him up. Okay, pretty straightforward, quite easy. That's one done. The next I'm going to put the 12 volt cigarette lighter and that's going to go in the middle. So I've already connected, so it comes with, so let me show you what it comes with. One black, one red fused wire and then sort of two black wires uh, with double end on and another one to go to the battery. So these two ends will go to the battery okay the other two fit to this i'll show you that when we go along so next thing is i'm going to put this in the two reds are connected to the boss positive there we go it tells you all that quite straightforward and then pop him in like so and then this rubber fits in between those little gaps it does fit quite nicely actually there we go let me just do that again so it fits between there like that okay hold it nice and tight and then oh, pretty straightforward and there you go line them up done the third one of course this is your voltmeter and your usb so you'll get you'll get a readout hopefully voltage there then you've got your two USB ports, so that's going to go that way up, and that's going to pop in there like so. We will be giving this a test, by the way. Okay, so single one on. You don't want to cross thread them because you'd have to, I don't know where you get these from, you'd have to, I don't know actually. You'd probably end up gluing them in. Okay, straighten him up, tighten him down. So that's what I'm doing with mine. Okay, to, to wire this up very simply, the first thing you need to do, well, it's up to you what you do, but you need your red wire to come in from your battery to the switch. This is my switch, okay? So we're just going to pop that. It doesn't actually say positive negative, it doesn't matter because they're both positive. You'll see why in a second. So we're just going to pop him. Make sure he goes on, like so. So this now will go to the battery. It doesn't matter which one you put it on, but I'm just going to put it at the top because the switch is like on and off. I hope it's that way round, okay? So I'll put the top one positive. This will go to the battery. The two I put on the 12 volt cigarette lighter, which is the twin one, okay? So one of these is going to come from the switch, all right? 
and that goes on there. I'm just make sure it's the right way up. It doesn't really matter. It just makes sure there's a there's a clip that locks them into place with a little hole. You see, there's a little hole in the just in there in the centre, and it does lock in there. So, okay, that's that one. So then, what happens is, so you've got live coming in, feeding the switch live, and then from the switch out live coming out, feeding the cigarette lighter positive side cigarette lighter live so this now should be live afterwards and i'll show you that now and the next one is because you want your voltmeter so on your voltmeter you have a positive and a negative so this one then loops around and pops onto that one and there you go so that's your positive positive so these now are looped live okay and now you've got this one so what you do with this one is you put a negative on this side so just pop him on there and then you've got another negative which will go on the one in the middle which is your cigarette lighter like so so now what you're going to do you've got to connect these two to your battery and you've got a complete circuit so you've got live coming in out live out live back neutral back neutral back to the battery this is your switch that's why the two lives because what happens is then what you're doing is you're cutting the circuit when you switch it on and therefore it's breaking the circuit i well, have got a separate wire down here i can use to do a test on okay so let me just get that and i'll come back in these are fitting bits i don't know why they sent them they've got spares i suppose i suppose it's going to give you for the device I don't know. who knows who knows okay so anybody's interested what i use here um I've got a couple of these clips that I put together. If I can think what the name is of them, I did remember. And I bought a few with the crimper as well. And they're really handy. And this lead, um, what I've made up, gives me a way of I can connect in anything that I want to test to my test bed. It's the, it's the van, really. Oops. Sorry about that. Right, so this will go to my test bed, you see. And uh, what it is, it's just two wires with connected to the battery. And just to show what, there we go. So I keep them protected by putting the switch on it. But we'll take them off now and connect these, and we'll give this a test. Okay, black one, just strip the wires a bit, put them in. All right, now there's no light on the switch, it's just a two-way switch, on or off. So there you go, on. We should have, if he's done it right. I don't see any lights on that. No, there's no lights in that. So it's a pretty basic one, but look. Yeah, there you go. So it's, it's nine pound off eBay. Basic. We've got 12.6 volts. Oh, I thought we got on there. 12.6 volts. Uh, pretty straightforward. So just to re re re, re what whatever. There's the wiring, so switch in to live battery. Okay, it doesn't matter top or bottom, but we guess right, okay? And then you've got a loop, so you've got a two-way loop wire. So that goes into the center one on the positive, which I'm using now for the cigarette lighter. So in, connect that one, in, connect that one. So really it's in from the switch, live, positive, live, positive, neutral out, to neutralize so now these two become active and then this back to the battery and that's it positive and negative and we have life and that's it pretty straightforward if you enjoyed the vid give it a thumbs up so when it says it's pre it's pre-wired it isn't at all <laughs> which is fine because it's a bit of fun anyway all right take care if you enjoyed the video would really appreciate it if you give it a thumbs up and a like that would be great it helps the algorithms on the channel and uh, helps, just helps with the channel. All right, take care. Catch you in the next one.